I'm 25. 25. 25 years old, though. First skate video? I want to say Rodney Mullen versus Day One Song, to be honest. I mean, everything now, nowadays is online, but still the Plan B video, of course. Um, the Vulcan video is amazing. Yeah. Everybody killed a shot of Louis Lopez. My dog killed it first part. It's uh, crazy to see how far, I mean, I've came. I never thought I would be skateboarding. Like, first of all, my mom was like, yo, you don't want to try basketball or football? I'm like, no, oh. cousin got me into skateboarding. And it just been, it's just been fun since, and, I mean, we living. But it's a blessing, man, for real. I always look back at it, because uh, I had nothing. So just to be able to have some, and able to take care of moms and pay bills, so it's a blessing, so we good. And I just talked to him recently. Um, it's been so long, and you know when he came out, Baker Three came out swinging. I mean, that's like everybody's favorite skateboard. It's definitely mine. You got homie of mine, and, and it's sad. Um, we just try to keep him skating. He's doing better though, like less drinking. Yeah, man. We, we just want to see him skate. We we trying. I mean, it's up to him. I guess I think everybody is just like, damn, it's Antoine. It's Antoine. Like not that many people saying like, yo, you gotta chill out on all the drugs and all the alcohol. I mean. Teach his arm and everybody do what they gotta do, but I mean, sometimes, I mean, you gotta skate too, so I mean, it catches a hold on you. But he's doing good. Shout out to my big bro. Um, damn, who do I know? Well, we just did a Baker Deathfish tour. Um, I met that kid, Jamie Foy. Yeah. He kills it, so we were rooming together, chopping it up. He is gnarly. You know what? Um, I see. I've been like seeing the dudes here and there, but I'm doing like this Nike part, and I need two more tricks left. So I've been really just focusing on that. But uh, they've been going out. They've been getting in the van, and getting to it. So I'm gonna be a little late starter. But uh, so I can't really say your boy got a part yet, cause we don't got. Well, I think I do got some stuff, some old stuff that still look decent, that don't look old, that we could use. But um, so I haven't really started yet. Probably like two years, to be honest. It'll come out probably in like 2018, to be honest. Got a while. Probably be like Hell Eclipse, put it wherever, I guess. And um, a couple other dudes is working on one too, with Ty Evans. So started off with Shane Auckland, get home, and Corey Kenny's boy, and did a little bit of Beagle. And then uh, now Ty Evans, he'll probably help me film the last two. So I'm slipping. I had like chipped the bone. I don't know if we should get all that, but two more tricks, we there, we close. My trucks, when kids like, yo, can I have your board? You got anything but my trucks. You got bearings, wheels, my board, I don't care if it's new or old, but you can't get my trucks. No, sir. Um, Road Essentials, gotta have my chains with me. Have a couple chains, put on like five or something in case we go out. Gotta have my right uh, cologne. I'm gonna say perfume, cologne. I pack a big bag, so I got like, we've been on like a five day trip. I might bring like six boards, five or six shoes. Like it's like, yo, you, you can skate one shoe for like the whole trip. But yeah, gotta have my chains on in case your boy step out after a session. Might meet up with a girl or something. I mean, you know what? Like shout out to Nike, it's a great thing because uh, they stay keeping you busy. Like if you wanna go to China or something, you got a trick or spot in mind. It's all taken care of. So it's like, it's good, but it's like, it gets crazy when you gotta go trip after trip, back to back. That's like when I get homesick. Nah, Mike slipping. He didn't even tell me like the little sizzling, sizzling place. Now I gotta holler at him. Oh yeah, so yeah, go bowling when I'm bored. Like, I always fall asleep in the movie. So unless we go super early in the daytime, like two or three, then I'm gonna be up. You go like six, seven. A good like 30 minutes and everybody look over like, damn, this nigga sleep, waste some money. But I did stay up, stay up for Fear of Seven though. That was definitely interesting, it was sad that West Name died. Um, it's a great movie. I love Peach Cobbler, favorite dessert. Yeah, I guess that's it, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, going to uh, Dubai, like walking in the only six star hotel, it was like balling. And then uh, cops pull up, they drive Ferraris, Bentleys, and we was like the prince guest. They was like, yo, you can't skate one phone call. Boom, skating the most best marble uh, ground. We probably could skate inside the mall if we wanted to. But uh, yeah, just going to Dubai. Oh yeah, skydiving. That was crazy, never again. 
I'm scared of heights, but it's like the only reason why I did this is because everybody else was going to do it. I didn't want to hear people like, yo, why didn't you do it? Pussy or whatever. So I'm like, damn, I want to be the only one that didn't try it. The lady, she locked me in. We both hopped. She pushed me off first and she hopped, she hopped out. And the instance, once I hopped out the air, I couldn't breathe. I was trying to take off the goggles. She was like, no, snatched them. I was excited to hit the ground. So when I hit the ground, you know, I like throw up sometimes and it went right back in my mouth. It's terrible. Never again, but uh, yeah, Dubai was tight. Oh yeah, we played with, with with the lion. And I was like, yo, damn, I want to take a picture with a lion, but I ain't say, I ain't want the motherfucker to be next to me. I just want to be like that outside the gate. So they was like, yo, this is what you wanted. And I was like, the lady was like, yo, don't, don't panic. Don't show any option that you scared because he might attack. So it was fucked up. Man, shout out to everybody out there that's doing their thing, man. Stay focused, stay out of trouble, stay on the board, continue to push yourself every day and don't let nobody tell you you can't become a professional skateboarder. You could uh, do whatever you want, just uh, stay focused and be yourself at the end of the day. If you do those things and live by them, I guarantee you, it'll be great. Real talk.